Hi, I'm Christopher Gray with Living Well Family Office, and today we're looking at a fresh document that came out recently by U.S. Trust and Bank of America. They did a study that was a very thorough study of 640 wealthy Americans that have investable assets of $3 million or more. They did a, a survey of them going through uh, what is important to them, what does it look like for a life well lived. On page four, there's a diagram that I believe is very critical. It, talks about what is essential and what is important. And what has been determined as essential to a life well lived by the affluent in America are three things. And that is financial security, health, and family. Which again, as a living well family office, we've focused intentionally on family, health, and wealth. And in fact, in that order. Almost unanimously, 98% of wealthy Americans believe that health, their health and well-being is actually their most valuable asset. Another important item that this study revealed is that family brings the greatest sense of enjoyment to the affluent, and yet only one-fifth of the families believe that their children are prepared and ready to handle the wealth of the family. To us, that's a travesty because our children should stand on our shoulders. We should prepare them and help give them the tools, counselors, and guides around them to see them not only accomplish what we have done, but go far beyond for generations to come and that is true dynastic family wealth. Now we know at Living Well Family Office that preparing children is a cornerstone, not only of family harmony, but also of seeing the children really stand on our shoulders for the next generation. To see these assets used to make a positive impact, not only in their lives, but also in the lives of others. We believe that when our children are, are healthy, clear-minded, and engaged in their professional endeavors, it's only going to cause a greater level of success to flourish all around them because we really believe that success breeds more success. 118 of the 640 people surveyed were business owners. Now with a multifamily office, naturally we work with a lot of entrepreneurs. It is important to note that they are included in this study as well. Another important concept or idea that was laid forth in this article is on page five and it says, consider a personal or family mission statement. Now, we at Living Well Family Office couldn't agree with U.S. Trust more on that point. I think it's imperative that a family has a clear sense of mission, purpose, vision, core values. Oftentimes when we work with families at a family retreat, we're able to help guide that family to craft a purpose statement, a vision statement, a set of core values that define what the family stands for even a philanthropic plan for the long term that the kids can be an integral part of that and carrying on the legacy for many years to come. Another idea set forth in this document is a heavy emphasis on health and wellness. Clearly the affluent in America are beginning to value this more and more. In fact, of the wealth holders that are 70 years old and above, they stated the vast majority would spend an unlimited amount of their resources for their health and wellness. And that's important, and I appreciate how they laid out that good health really is a cornerstone of a life well lived. The other thing I'd like to bring your attention to is on page seven. It states, the wealthy invest their mental, physical, and emotional health and are willing to seek the best care, coaches, and counselors to assist them. However, our survey respondents were far more likely to be interested in preemptive, preventative services, like getting a full body scan, genetic testing, and so forth. So what we found here in Malibu with the Living Well Family Office is a real interest of these families to understand the preventative wellness plans that can help not only them as the matriarch and patriarch, but also to help their children and their grandchildren to live a life of strength and energy and vitality. At Living Well Family Office, we have a series of wellness advisors that are poised to help families develop that wellness plan and not only create a plan, but to coach them through that process, connecting them with subject matter experts in a whole array of disciplines within the preventative health space. Could be acupuncture, naturopathic doctors, chiropractors, nutritionists, dietitians, and so forth. There's a whole host of professionals that are poised and ready to stand behind our family clients and see them thrive. Another element of the study is an emphasis on the importance of key health directives and documents. At Living Well Family Office, we help families not only create a wealth dossier that lays out all the different elements of their wealth, but on the estate portion of that, we address healthcare directives and so forth in a very accessible, clean, organized fashion. 
So those are just a few of my professional thoughts as a family office practitioner on this most recent study by U.S. Trust. I just want to again affirm and thank them for the work that they've done and for the families that are out there thinking about how can I create a brighter future for my family. We're standing by to help you with family meetings, family financial planning, health and wellness plans and so forth. Our team of subject matter experts are here to stand behind your family and see you flourish.